Okay, today we're, we're in the rough, as you can see, and we're really close to the green. When I'm in this area, one of the things that I try to look at is I try to look at what, what I can I do to pin seek a little bit more. The shot that I prefer in this area is probably the bump and run. And I wanna go through it with you right now in regards to some of the things that you need to do to prepare for that shot. Number one is shorter shot, shorter shaft. Go right down to the end of your shaft. That's a key here. The second thing is with the bump and run, you wanna play the ball off the back foot. So you'll get the ball almost right off of the back foot and get yourself aligned so that your shoulders are going towards your target line. The whole objective here is not to hit it at the pin or to the pin, but it, what it is is to hit it onto the green so that it'll release and go to the pin. So when you're there, you're going to go ahead and you're going to place the ball off the back foot. You're going to go ahead and get about 75% of your weight on the front side, get your shoulder down so that the swing or the stroke that you're going to actually take is more like an aggressive punch or a bump. That's it. Just like that. And if you see, it's a very short follow through and it's very low. So if I get myself set, and you can see it hits and it releases. And the key of where you're going to go ahead and make it land on the green is going to be based upon the club that you have in your hands. If I'm 30 feet away from my target, and I'm using a sand wedge, I'm going to try to make it land on the green about 15 feet away from where I'm heading. So it's 15 feet and it'll roll release 15 feet. If it's a pitching wedge, 15 feet, it'll release 30 feet. If it's a 7 iron, 15 feet, 45 feet. And if it's a 5 iron, 15 feet, 60 feet. And, and practice this a lot. How you can do it is to put, a, put some tees out here in your, on your green and practice hitting it only to that area. Now, this type of a shot, a bump and run, could be done here, out of the rough. It also could be done off of the fringe. You can do it here, but you also know that off the fringe you have another option, and that is you can putt it. But you know, it has to be how comfortable you are with this shot. And if, you're, and if you have a good short game, this is, a, this is one where you're going to be able to get it closer to the pin and hence you're going to probably be able to reduce the number of putts you have over 18 holes. How's that?